Guys, I'm fleeing the country. I haven't been in the airport for nine months. Probably. You're so brave for that, genuinely. I'm so brave for that, too, bad. Stanford. With my favorite guy. Um, come on. <laughs> No boyfriend, you guys know him. He's so icky. He's, He's so icky. He is definition of ick. Guess where we're going today? I'm gonna guess Italy. No, oh, we're going to Mallorca. Maga, Maga Loof. No, we're not actually going Maga. We're going to the opposite side of the island. Not going for a party holiday, guys. I'm honestly buzzing. I haven't been able to go away for so long. The travel vlogs are coming back, guys. Anyways, I'll see you guys on the plane. Good, this feels the smell, the hot air, everything. I'm sweating, even though because I'm in like a full tracksuit. But like, we're living, I'm literally back in my element. <laughs> I can't even scream because my voice is fucked. Make so out. Uh, yes, oh. oh wow, look how big this bed is. Okay, being able to see me shower. What are you saying? Oh my god, we made it. Look how he's left my fucking suitcase outside, calm. <laughs> What is that about? <laughs> he is such a gentleman. Oh my god, look, you got terrace. Come on, let's go outside. Um, Scenes. I got no SPF on. You stupid. That pool is bloody delicious. Oh my god, I didn't even see that. It's like a fucking kitchen. It's so funny how open plan the bathroom is. Like, this bitch gonna see my cooch. You've never seen it before. I'm your boyfriend, bitch. No, he's never seen it before. It's really awkward. Quick, I'm gonna have to do a test. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's nice. Nap time. No, it's not nap time. It's like next to the pool time. I'm hungry. I'm, I'm putting on my flip flops and I'm ready to go. This is not the energy we want for this holiday calm. Wake the fuck up. I'm hungry. We made it. Living our best lives. This is sensational. This is literally just what the doctor ordered. Also, why my forehead need Botox at 21? Guys, it's sushi sash. <laughs> Yeah. Oh my god, this is actually how royalty lives. Is that a joke? I have to this treat is... my princess. Of course, baby. Who's paid for the whole trip, though? You are. Me. We've got a beautiful club sandwich, some free. And can't we got a Caesar because he's so healthy. But I thought, fuck the shred, fuck the summer body. Anybody's a summer body. So who cares, right? But I'm not gonna lie to you guys. We've been napping for around an hour and a half. Very, very jet like The eight hour flight over here has really knocked us out. But now we're going out to the Sibmashi. My favorite part of every foreign country, to be fair, because it's just way more interesting than a bloody waitress, isn't it? Now, this is what we're talking about. Proper foreign supermarket. I love it. These slaps. I don't even know what that means. You just know they slap. You can never ever be too far from home. Hey, eh? should we crack open the WAKD tonight? Okay. Scenes right now. Call me having a mocha and us at the beach. I've already invested in a few anklets and a few bracelets, and that's when you know you're starting a holiday. So we're here for like under two weeks, and this vlog will go out a week before we come back. So if you guys have ever been to Mallorca, anywhere in Mallorca, we're staying in Poyenza, Alcudia. Comment down below some suggestions because we need them. We're staying in a really nice villa next week, which will be fucking gorgeous. But for the time being, we're just hoteling it. Hotel Trivago. Oh, didn't see you there. You can't tell already. I do have tan lines. I don't know, who would have thought? Honestly, first day. Oh, you can't. Oh, yes, you can. You can see that. I was going to have a little chit chat about Spain and like, how difficult it was to get in here. All I had to do was take a PCR test 48 hours before my flight, which I got. I was shit scared for because I was ill in bed for like four days before that. And I was like, definitely have the Delta variant. Fucked it. But it didn't. I'm actually better now. I didn't actually have any COVID symptoms, but everyone was like, you have COVID, you have COVID. I was like, I don't because I didn't have any of the symptoms which they said that there would be if I did have COVID. So, also double vax now. So, 48 hour PCR test. And then also do a Spanish locator for. It is really difficult to get into different countries now, but you know what? In the end, it's so worth it. Also, I think the PCR test was £90 because I got it through my flight provider, which is Jet2. So it was cheaper than the most ones because I think if you get it separately, it's like 120 which is like no money. But I think it's worth the content, right? Worth the travel vlogs. I'm getting back on my shit and I'm. So excited for it. I honestly am. I feel like I'm a napper again. Fuck, get me out of the fucking town. No jokes. I need detox. I need an actual detox. Okay, okay. She dressed up for the sixes. Guess who we're going tonight? An Italian. Yes, you heard of here first. My Italian boyfriend wants to go to an Italian, which is cliche as what? We're just gonna fill this belly full of pasta and then get a fat night's sleep. What is happening there? <laughs> That's terrifying. I'll see you when I have a big fat bowl of pasta in front of me. Okay, so I kind of lied. I decided to go for the healthy option. Parma ham with melon and a mozzarella and tomato salad. Can we just all agree to disagree that we look rough on the first day of holiday? Always. Eye bag shining. Hair greasy. Hail. Can't really do anything about it. If you haven't had parma ham and melon, you haven't lived. It's so oh, what gorgeous scenes to end the night. This is fucking stunning. And a mask on the floor. Oh, gorgeous. Dripping. Oh, that's so pretty, actually. Wow. Let's post the scenes. Three, two, one. 
That's kind of cute. Family holiday. Yeah, <laughs> literally. So grateful. Guys, we wouldn't be here without you, so wow. shout out to you. This is us after 10 hours sleep. I am disgusting. How are we looking? Fresh. I can't wait for this buffet, not gonna lie. This is probably one of the bougiest buffets I've ever seen. Okay, breakfast. <laughs> This is dreadful. It has to happen. The first day of holidays, if you're a buffet, you have to try out every single type of pastry they have, including a donut. <laughs> I haven't even donuts for breakfast. That's a mess. I'm stuffed to the brim, got my bikini, and we're ready to go. Why well, I look pregnant though? I could easily pass a pregnant right now. Got the bikini on. We are thriving. By the way, the bikini's from Motel Rocks. My face, my juice, I just love this print. Very 70s. I feel like the 70s are gone back, aren't they? Oh my god, especially with my hair. What the hell is happening there? Okay, we're about to go down to the pool and have a little bit of a tan search. And then, not sure we're doing afterwards, we might be going to the water park. Don't know what's gonna happen. Just gonna have a little bit of a fun time. If you don't have fox tan, you haven't lived. Basically, speed tans you because you fucking need it. <laughs> is misguided right now and I am about to show you a haul of all of them. I am not going this summer looking like 2019 Kate because 2019 Kate needed a bloody smack in the face because what was she wearing? Why didn't my friends tell me? But anyways, here we are. First outfit. This is the prettiest little sling over the top of a bikini type dress. Let's say at the end of the day, you know, you're strolling on the beach in the sunset. This. Perfect. And underneath, you ready for it? Yeah, she's in all glory. Playboy, guys. Anything which has Playboy on it, hand it over to me. It's a nice little underwire bikini set. Also, tie up with the side is the most flattering type of bikini. Also, can we just not talk about how bad I am? Okay, I get it. There's a third piece. Here she is. I am obsessed. Three pieces of bikinis are coming in. It's also bikini material as well, so you can actually swim in it. My type on paper. And guess what? I have another color. And here it is. Also, it really holds the boobs in place in a perfect way. To me, this is sort of like Y2K. You know me? I love a Y2K moment. If I'm being honest, I feel like a Love Island contestant in this swimsuit. Orange is a very underrated color. The back is low cut, therefore, we're gonna get a banging tan still. And I feel like this bikini is a very flattering and also perfect for one of those days where it's like you're a little bit too bloated. Had a bit of a heavy run night before. This will cover it. I've never actually worn one of these bikinis before and I'm kind of loving it. Like the high waist at the moment is actually a vibe. If I turn around, I'll get demonetized. So I'm just gonna leave to the front. But right in the front, always, right guys? It's just so sweet with the little detailing. I love the fact that it's got a little crisscross moment. I actually wore this yesterday, I saw my vlog, but this is the little crochet moment. It's so cute. Just a little halter neck. So useful for like just after a beach day, during a beach day, throughout the whole entire beach day. The only thing I'd do is probably make it a little bit shorter because I'm a slut. Yeah, I said it. Wearing white holidays with tan brown skin. Well, actually, red skin. We couldn't help ourselves. You have to take me away from lack of print because I will buy it. Also, these bottoms. They ain't coming off yet. If you want to do a front crawl swim, they won't be flying off like those little itty bitty bikinis which you usually wear. It's quite hot, but as a little cover up, I thought that I'd go with the same theme as Playboy. The best overshirt to have on the beach. You see, it's like a toweling material, so you'll literally get dry while looking stylish as fuck. My mindset behind these trackies was that I was gonna wear them to the airport, but it was too hot on the way to the airport, so I couldn't. I'm really putting myself out there wearing this many clothes in 30 degrees heat, but we're gonna do what we're gonna do. It's got the nicest waistband, not too tight, not too loose. And now onto going out clothes. This is stunning. It's like a little milkmaid dress, which is literally so pretty. I just love the whole entire aesthetic of it. Also, it fits so well. Like, skater dresses never miss. I feel fancy in this. I feel very Bridgerton. I haven't worn heels in months. But look at these beauties. Okay, no one judge my toes, but look how pretty these heels are. 
strutting. Actually, they'll suit any outfit. Okay, night out vibe. If I was to go on a crazy night out, this is what I was going to wear. This is definitely something I'm going to wear now the clubs are open. A hundred percent. It makes me look curvier than I am. It's very, very, very flattering when I am built like a plank of wood. The vibe of like the back, the marbling, very on trend. I definitely see this more as like a mum going to tennis type of vibe. One piece, sunglasses, boom, you're done. Just such a simple piece which can just make heads turn. Pretty sure you can see my nipples, but that's okay. You know what? It's fashionable. If Rachel from Friends can do it, you can do it. Also, I love these sunnies. So just a little bit of a cat eye moment, but like not too cat eye because sometimes too cat eye looks a bit meme. And for the last outfit, a little bit more conservative, a little bit more dinner with the parents type vibes, sexy little cohort. You can see my Mr. Ivy, right? You know, with a future boyfriend's parents. <laughs> and for the finale, we have this Peng Playboy hoodie. Check the back out, but and also these joggers. The most perfect ash grey joggers in the world. So this basically is already in a cord, which is also got like an ash grey crew neck in it, but I did not want to wear that right now. So all the stuff I literally just showed us now is going to be linked in my description. Definitely shop the new misguided summer season. It is chef's kiss. And of course, I have a discount code for you. It is Kate Elizabeth to get money off, which you will definitely appreciate when you look at the summer section. So yeah, there's going to be a link in my description for all the things I wore. And yeah, thank you so much, misguided, for sponsoring this video. And let's get on with the rest of the holiday. Guys, I'm not going to lie. I'm one after all spread steep. I'm why do I look like this? Oh, I we look so brown. No, babes. You don't. We look so tanned. I mean, ooh. You literally wetted my ear. Show me who it is. Our date. <laughs> so we did this really weird thing where we pretend we're with people just because it's like awkward and then like yeah, they've like yeah. gone to go to like the toilet or something yeah, but like, we order like double the food so we can basically eat it all so it's not awkward when people walk past oh okay. shit oh maybe we do have people here <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. This is breakfast. This is why you don't flash, guys. It's not, it's not worth it. And breakfast is served. I was lying about the water, guys. I do need to put in my stomach. Even though I am so bad. I'm burnt to the point where, like, if I touch it, it feels like a bruise. Idiot. I'm moving to hotels today. Still in our Kudia. 10 minutes out of the road. <laughs> we just want to do some hotel hopping. Just pulled up to our second hotel. Let's have a little look, shall we? Oh wow, curtains closed. They know the vibe. We love. Why, they like this? Why is there so much space here? Stop being stuck up. Oh. Shut it. Oh wow, it's bloody huge. <gasps> this. This is what I'm talking about. That's vibes. <gasps> Look at the views, the scenes. It's so pretty. I am not complaining. Bed test. Oh, I'll give that three eight out of ten. Mommy. Oh. All right, ladies, it is a bloated and burnt day today. So we're putting on a swimsuit because I'm insecure. I said it. Just the owner TD. I just smacked my camera. I, <laughs> I tried to go outside onto the terrace and I went straight into the door. Look at the mask. What's that one? <laughs> Kate, what is, what is that? That was my thigh. I can't. Oh my god, this looks bloody incredible. Are you joking? Wow, lunch is so. Look at that. Oh, we're really living life, baby. Give me a high five. Yeah. That's the cringest thing we've ever done. You're so icky. Give me the ick. You're icky. Like the good mum I am, I'm going to start swimming some laps because I douse myself in pasta. I need to exercise that shit off. What gorgeous lane, which has my name on it just there. I'm also burnt, so I don't know if I should actually go in the pool in the first place, but go low. I didn't realize how exhausting swimming is. And also, I just ate. You should never have ever swimming too soon after you've eaten. Otherwise, you're gonna die. Why don't we right now? I'll give myself 20 minutes and I'll be in there, I think. Oh shit. Oh, oh. <laughs> Very four star energy. <laughs> Calm. Quality A star entertainment for today. Can you imagine someone just like, what? And another one. My head began to hit the wall. Bang. At least they're replacing the mattresses, though, I guess. Like, props to them. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh, you know it has to be done. I did it. She's wild, but she's free. Nothing. Can't talk right now, dude. Hot girl shit. <laughs> this is no context for you. I don't gonna say what it is, but you're doing hot girl shit. Cow, cow. Can you stop snorkeling? <laughs>
it's so not good. We've got quite a lot of spots. I don't know why. Maybe the sun's bringing them out. Pizza face. It's fucking hot in here. That's so mean. It's you really can't. Hot in the yeah, I know. Okay, I'll turn down. God, it's so hard living with a fucking child. Hello, TD. Bershka two piece, which I am literally in love with. I look like a pretty little country girl going out for my sushi. Because obviously, we're going out for sushi. Do you even know me? Hate a sushi sesha. <laughs> No, you know. Oh, I think I may have just finished. Um. <laughs> Sorry, Rob, if you're watching. Oh god, we're being treated tonight. This is absolutely stunning. We're paying. <laughs> Cheers, that. Oh, Lord, look what Kami's found. Which one should I go for? Um, I want that pony. You sit back and relax for right love. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. This is such a catfish. We need to go for one of these. Is that it? Do I get to go again? Is that it? For a euro? So expensive for a fucking piece of shit. Oh my god.